But Congressman Jody Arrington is introducing legislation in memory of his Plainview High School classmate, a veteran who took his own life after he left the service. Arrington wants to devote more money now to helping veterans adjust to civilian life, and he talked to KMAX Anna Warnicke about it. He was strong, he was tough. And uh, he, he was a warrior's warrior. It's been a year, but Texas Republican Congressman Jody Arrington says he remembers every detail. His friend and classmate, Navy SEAL Chief Petty Officer Bill Mulder, took his own life. I'm standing in Arlington Cemetery at his internment with his family, uh, his three young children, and his wife. Arrington says Mulder struggled adjusting to life at home after he left the service. We didn't know. No one knew. Arrington has introduced a bill in Mulder's honor. The Transition Improvement Act of 2018 would target active duty service members one year before they return home. It would also provide money for job training and connect them with support organizations within their community. We are in crisis. Texas Democrat Beto O'Rourke, a co-sponsor, says the bill would pair active duty soldiers with counselors to help them throughout their frequently difficult transition. According to the Department of Veterans Affairs, 20 veterans take their lives every single day. It's going to literally save lives and, and give those lives greater purpose and function and ability to contribute to the greater success of this country. We don't want to wait until they're homeless and until they're suicidal. We want to get with them on the front end and earlier. Arrington says he hopes to bring the bill to the House floor in the next few weeks. In Washington, I'm Anna Warnicke.